We are counting down what we believe are the top five Georgia State Parks today. As we count down these top five Georgia State Parks, make sure down in the comments to leave us your favorite Georgia State Park or anything you think we left off of this list. Coming in at number five in the town of Helen, Georgia, is Unicoi State Park. So much to do here. This is a beautiful park and the activities alone put it over the top. You have Anna Ruby Falls nearby, the town of Helen that we just mentioned, the camping and lodging accommodations here also put it over the top and they even have zip lining here. The lake trail is going to be one of the better hiking trails you can do in all of the Georgia State Parks. Beautiful views looking out over the lake itself. Unicoi definitely beat out a few other ones that were pretty close to it as far as quality state parks just because it is right there in the town of Helen and there's so much to do and see there you got to get in town and check it out you get the mountain coaster there you got wonderful restaurants there and just to walk around to all the shops and the atmosphere itself is just incredible well next up is number four and that is Amicalola Falls State Park and Lodge just northeast of Atlanta, Georgia, maybe within an hour of Atlanta. And this is a spectacular state park, one of the most beautiful waterfalls in all of Georgia. I'll tell you, this is maybe a top two or three waterfall in the whole state of Georgia. Well, next up, coming in at number three, is Tallulah Gorge State Park. Man, there is so much to see and do here. They have their own private beach, lots of hiking trails, and their waterfalls are spectacular. I don't know if you can feel this bridge shaking. It's awesome. Coming in at number two is Cloudland Canyon State Park in the upper northwestern part of Georgia. And this is the best hiking that I have seen at any of the state parks in Georgia. It's famous for its rim trail, so you definitely want to check that out. And there are two waterfalls that you can see while you're camping or visiting here.
Cloudland Canyon has several ways you can go camping there. They do have yurts as well as two different campground loops for RVs and travel trailers. And they have plenty of cabins to do some cabin camping as well. The West Rim Trail here at Cloudland Canyon is easily one of the best hikes that we have done at any state park in Georgia. And coming in at number one is Vogel State Park, just outside of Blairsville, Georgia. And I'll tell you that this isn't just the best state park in Georgia. This ranks as one of the best state parks I've seen anywhere in the country. There's so much to do here. The lake is so serene, so beautiful. They have a waterfall hike right on site. Uh, the trails are pet friendly, lots of camping accommodations, and the nearby waterfalls that you can take in at Helton Creek are just incredible. Cabin 35 right here at Vogel State Park is the best view I have seen of any cabin in all of Georgia at their state parks. They had two of these fishing docks that you could use, as well as a beautiful beach that's obviously really popular in the summertime. And in the summer, they even rent kayaks and paddle boats right there. But what sets Vogel apart is the camping. So many campsites and several of them right on the water with a little creek running behind your campsite. One of the added bonuses to staying at Vogel State Park is the main entrance to Vogel is just a half a mile from Helton Creek Falls, one of the prettiest waterfalls in all of Georgia. I would say it's a top three or four waterfall, in fact, in Georgia, and it's just down the street and a real treat if you're staying there at the park. Well, all of the state parks that we featured in this top five, we're going to post their individual video links down in the description below so you can check those out. And remember in the comments, why don't you tell us which state park you think we should have added to this list. And if this video was helpful to you, give us a thumbs up down below as well. And more importantly, we would love it if you subscribe to the channel and came along with us on all of these adventures. And until next time, get out there and camp, travel, and explore.